we started development of Company of Heroes 3 and we asked our players what they wanted to see, one of the number one things was variety of environments. And there's no other theater in World War II that brings this variety. You have beautiful hills and mountains of Italy, the beaches of Italy, all the way to the sands and deserts of North Africa. The visual theme for Company Heroes 3 is something we call Life at War and really helps to guide a lot of our artistic decision-making process. It's really about depicting life in the Mediterranean, the beautiful culture, and then contrasting that uh, with war and, and destruction. So in Company of Heroes 3, we have more fighting forces than ever before, and our battle group system allows us to do that. So we have our factions, UK, US, German uh, factions we've had before, but in addition, we have battle groups from around the world and they can be added to your armies uh, to have an international flavor to the battles that were present in World War II and in the Mediterranean theater. The Mediterranean theater gives us a broader palette for environmental gameplay, which is a huge part of Company of Heroes. It always has been. We've also got an improved destruction system so that the urban combat really does feel more perilous, more dangerous, but also more tactical than ever before. So when a building is damaged and eventually collapses, it can kill squads nearby with the rubble that's falling. You can also take cover in the rubble or the ruins of, of certain buildings. Everything we do in Company of Heroes has to involve gameplay. So even the visuals have to have gameplay behind them. Our destruction has always had gameplay. And so with a new theater, that's the first thing we have to look at. And so with Mediterranean, you know, you start in North Africa and you have these open deserts. Well, of course, what gameplay is that going to bring? First of all, it's going to bring big tank battles where you're flanking from miles away, trying to get behind the enemy. We have lots more gameplay features we're going to be sharing specific to North Africa. But then you go to Italy. Italy is all about mountainous terrain and choke points and valleys and setting up, you know, bottlenecks. And so it's much different gameplay. The environmental diversity in the Mediterranean theater, it allows for a new type of vertical height-based gameplay. So we've got maps, environments in Company of Heroes 3 that are more mountainous or hilly than any maps we've had before. And you can gain an advantage by taking the high ground. So that's something we're excited about. The enemy can take that advantage as well. That's why we're so excited. There's so much gameplay that comes along with the Mediterranean theater, and we think our players are going to love it.